The consequences of mutations on gene expression are often assessed qualitatively by in situ hybridization and generally scored visually, which is subjective and biased by the researcher's expectations. This method provides a more consistent way to compare in situ experiments by quantifying image intensities and removes that bias. This can also be easily adapted to other model systems that use in situ hybridization as a read of gene expression. Start by imaging the in situ hybridization or ISH stained embryos. Prepare a glycerol solution and mix it to homogenize. Transfer the embryos to the glycerol solution with a 3 ml Pasteur pipette and leave them to settle for at least 5 minutes. Prepare and label enough PCR tubes to transfer the ISH stained embryos after imaging. Then, use a 3 ml Pasteur pipette to add 100% glycerol to the bottom of the well of a glass depression slide. Transfer a single ISH stained embryo to the glass slide and orient it under a stereo microscope equipped with a digital camera and bottom and top illumination. Using the first embryo, adjust the illumination and exposure time at the desired magnification. Image as many embryos as required and label each image with a unique number. After imaging, transfer each embryo to a PCR tube labeled with the same number and if needed, aspirate the excess glycerol from the PCR tubes. To extract the DNA, add 40 to 70.